Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all well. So today I have filmed this look that I've got on now and I've used all Hourglass products. So they kindly sent me some products the other week and I've been using them every day since because I'm obsessed with them. So I thought I would film a video. A lot of you have asked for a whole video based on one brand. So I thought this would be the perfect brand to start with. This video is not sponsored at all. I just love these products and I think you will too if you love natural makeup. Please don't forget to like and subscribe, that would be so helpful for me and I hope you enjoy the video. Okay so first, so I've already put on my skincare routine and I've just put on some Charlotte Tilbury flawless filter but you've seen me put that on so many times so this is more about hourglass. Okay so first I'm going to use the foundation. So this is a foundation stick which I think is really cool. And what I will say about this brand is the packaging is just unreal. Like, it just feels so luxury, I love it. This is the foundation stick and this is in the shade Nude. Now I would say that this is probably a tiny bit too dark for me, but we are in summer now, even though it's like four degrees. So I know that this will be fine in like a month's time or a few weeks time. It comes in a stick and you just twist it up. Let me just draw it onto my face. I'll probably do around three lines on each side. Down my nose. So I've been using this now for, sent me it about two weeks ago or a week ago and I tried it all because I just wanted to see what it was like because I've never used it before. Oh and also this brush is so good with the foundation. What I love about this foundation is it really is like skin. It's like you're putting on just a perfect layer of skin. And so I've just zoomed in a little bit closer you can see you can see how it goes on. Annoyingly my storage just ran out as I was doing this. But as I was saying it's I can't even describe it. It's not matte and it's not dewy. It is honestly just it's like second skin. So with this brush I just really buff it in. Like honestly guys, this is my new favourite foundation. I'm so obsessed with it, I can't wait to get some more stuff from them because... Can you see that? It makes you look airbrushed, that is what I am trying to say. I'm also just going to put on some of the lip oil quickly. This is, also the packaging on this is insane. Uh, this is really hydrating. So the foundation is done and it honestly just gives you like an airbrushed effect. It's so nice and I think with this brush as well, this is like obviously the perfect brush for this foundation because I just feel like it pushes it into your skin. Okay and now for concealer I am using the Hourglass Concealer in the shade Fawn, and you know how much I love my NARS. I say this is on par with NARS, but this one is just a tiny bit creamier, which I really like. I feel so bad for saying that. If you love natural makeup like me, I really think you will love this brand if you haven't tried it already. If this was all of the makeup that I owned, I would be happy with that. That's how much I love this makeup. Okay, now I'm just going to lightly set that and I'm using the powder they have sent. It's the Val. This is honestly my new favourite powder. I am i cannot tell you how happy I am that I've started to use these products. This brush, I think this is quite an iconic brush. I've seen so many people have this, so many makeup artists have this and it's so soft. So it's double ended and I just use the smaller end the powder and the powder is like a yellow banana -y colour and I'm just going to pat that under my eyes. Okay 
This is super lightweight, it doesn't feel powdery at all. The fact that I'm putting this all over my face kind of proves that because I am not a big powder fan. Okay, next I'm gonna do my brows. I actually did manage to get my eyebrows done the other week by Sophia, my girl, and I had a lash lift, which has honestly just changed my face. My eyebrows were just out of control. So this is the Glass Arch um, Brow Pencil and it's in Soft Brunette. I am just going to fill in the end. So as you can see on the end there's some gaps. I'm not sure why, just it's the way my hair grows. This is really like the perfect colour. So if you have my kind of hair colour where you're not a really warm brown but you're not also a dark brown then this would be perfect. Okay, now I'm gonna quickly go off camera and bronze. I haven't got a bronzer from them, so I'm just gonna use my classic Chanel bronze, but I will be looking for a bronzer from them, so maybe in one of my next videos I will use one, but for now I'm just gonna quickly use my Chanel. So I've bronzed and I did just do some blush, and I actually used this new one from NARS. It's the Air Matte Blush in the shade Hushed, which is my new favorite, it's so good. So next let's move on to lashes. Um, I'm going to use this one and it's the Caution Lash Mascara. This packaging is so good, like this feels so heavy, it's just so nice. This is in Ultra Black. is the mascara. It is insane. Okay, lashes are done. I'm now gonna use the lighting palette. This is like a highlighting palette, but it's more of like an all-rounder. It's got three shades, and I kind of just mix them all together. just gives you an all over glow. To finish I'm going to use the lipstick which is also the packaging once again. This is like a pen. I just love it. Oh this is in the shade When I Was and I love how tiny this is it just fits perfectly onto your lip and that is just the perfect peachy nude okay guys that is my hourglass look finished it's just super fresh and natural I feel like this is the perfect makeup if you love natural makeup I am honestly obsessed with this brand. This is my new favourite. I could literally do, use these products every day and not get bored of them. So I'm really excited to try out some more and I will share it with you. When I get thank you so much for watching if you got this far and I will see you in my next video.